Before I start today's video process, I would like to tell you about a tool that is Tenorshare 4ME key. This tool got the new update. Now you can bypass iOS 15 and 16 on the Checkmate jailbreak supported devices. You just need to connect the device, put your device into the DFU mode. After that tool will do some processing and do the jailbreak. Next you need to put your device again into the DFU mode in order to complete the bypass. After that you will see the bypass is done. So if you want to try it and interested in this tool, check out the description link for complete information. So now let's continue today's video process. So hey everyone, this is Just a Tech and welcome back to the channel. So today I got this older iPad mini first generation that is running on the iOS 9 like the 9.3.5 or 9.3.6 that is currently the latest iOS version for these older iPad mini one. So if you also have these older iPad models, so you can follow the same process and easily jailbreak your device and install the Cydia on it. And the same method works for the iPhones that is running on the older iOS 9, that is the iPhone 4S. So you can follow it same if you have that one. So first you need to open the three tools and connect your iPad or iPhone. Now you will see your device info and on the jailbreak status it's no so click on that the jailbreak now after that you will see this window now you will select the ipad and you will see the ios version and the jailbreak compatibility and the downside you will see the jailbreak version that is the phoenix jailbreak we want to use select that and proceed Now once it will complete it, you will see the Phoenix icon on your home screen and the device management will open. So now first you need to trust the app, go to the settings and after that go to the device management and trust the certificate. After that you can open the Phoenix jailbreak. So trust on it. Now you will see your iDevice identifier, the same process for the iPhones as well like iPhone 4s you can follow the same guide that will also work. Now you can close the three tools and disconnect the cable. After that you will see the prepare for jailbreak, tap on that, now accept it and click on the proceed for the jailbreak. Now you will see installing Cydia. So now begin installation. After that it will install. Now in the offset you can click on the system provide offset. After that it will proceed. And if you see the storage full error just ignore that click on done and it will proceed. And sometime the jailbreak will fail so keep trying that. After you will see the quick respring that means the jailbreak is done. And you will see the Cydia on your home screen. Now you can open it and enjoy the jailbreak. Now we have successfully jailbreak our iPad mini first generation on the iOS 9. Now you can update all your required packages from the Cydia library and after that you can use the jailbreak and it's very old model so sometime it lag but you can still use the Cydia and enjoy the full jailbreak experience. So this is the quick tutorial how you can jailbreak iOS 9.3.5 or 9.3.6 on your older iPads or iPhone with the Phoenix jailbreak. You can install with the same way and there are some method you can install it without computer also with the signing services. If you are interested and want me to make the video on that, just write it on the comments. So I will make the separate video for no PC jailbreak for you guys. So that is all for this video. I will see you in another one. So till then, goodbye, take care and peace out.